Come on, let me take you to all the places that I have traveled in the last 50 years. Hey guys, have you ever time traveled? As you grow old, you have lot of options to do such things. Sit down in your armchair and do a typical time travel back to 30 years or even older. Now I'm going to give you one such beautiful experience. Let's get back to the old Singapore of uh, 30 years back and then come back and see how it is now. I'm sure you'll enjoy this experience. Let us pack our bags and go back to 1986. This is the first trip I made to Singapore and subsequently I have made many other trips but this really stayed on my head even today. Let's go for a drive around the city and then you'll be surprised at the changes the city has undergone 30 years later. See the roads, they don't look all that green and the traffic, sparsely you can see cars going ahead. This was Singapore 40 years back. You can't imagine it now. Skyscrapers have started appearing sparsely here and there. Now, if you walk into Singapore, it will be a different picture. Now we are driving through the outskirts. And this is Singapore today. Let me take you on a drive around the city. The first thing you will notice is its greenery. They have developed the city really well with all greenery around. Next, you will notice its infrastructure, especially in the tourism sector. Okay, 
then the commercial activity will strike you the most see how nicely they have built up their commercial infrastructure now i'm going to let you enjoy the sights of singapore without any interruption from me let's go See those beautiful skyscrapers that have sprung up in the last 30 40 years. Beautifully designed and nicely located, it adds value to the city. See the importance that is given to the green aspect of their lives. They call it vertical gardening. Well, it really suits the name. Now we are driving towards the Asian area of the city. Let's drive through this Chinese part of the town and then we'll be entering the Indian part of the town which is called the Little India. Now we are driving towards the Arab area of the city. It's called the Baghdad Street. It has a mosque and a lot of small shops selling souvenirs. Five by four million. Maybe only 
10,000 people are like changing. The rest don't like me. Alright, ladies and gents, but if you look on the gold, uh, the gold, the onion, golden dome, uh, that will be the Salta Mall. We are driving back to the airport and uh, this is Singapore rain. It was amazing that Singapore has grown from a small fishing hamlet to such a metropolis. We have to give credit to those rulers who made it possible. And I'm leaving Singapore with a very nice feeling of having seen it in its early days and also its present position in the world. I'm planning to take you on a nostalgic trip of Singapore that was 30 years back. I'm sure it would be really fun for you to see how things were then. I'm sure you're going to be with me by subscribing to this channel, liking it and sharing. Thanks for watching.